Hi there, I'm Julia Borston. Welcome to this special edition of The Edge from the 2015 Consumer Electronics Show here in Las Vegas. It's said that CES is often a preview of the consumer tech trends set to make waves in the coming year. So in this episode, we'll check out that technology and talk to industry leaders. First up, let's take a quick look at what's hot at CES 2015. The Las Vegas Convention Center is full of the latest televisions. They're getting bigger and thinner, along with sleeker and more affordable smartphones. Take back TV. Dish unveiling a new way to watch live TV on these devices. Sling TV, a $20 monthly subscription to stream 11 cable channels, including ESPN and CNN raising questions about whether it'll inspire consumers to cut the cord. This is the logical next step. People have been wanting to have access to live content over the internet, and this is, this is a, a change that's been waiting to happen. And big names are here to showcase the latest gadgets. Ryan Seacrest promoting the new Typo, keyboards for iPhones and iPads, which he developed to meet his own needs. Which is sleek and it's smooth and it literally is my office. This is how I work every single day. Everything that I reply to is coming from one of our keyboards. This year more than ever, CES is about connecting everyday household tools and devices to the internet to make them smart. Everything from this GE smart living room security camera and fan to this LG smart kitchen and this Qualcomm smart light bulb, which consumers can control from an app on any device. You're really seeing a lot of intelligence in the home and, and in homes that aren't necessarily brand new. These are places that have been around and you can install kind of a layer on top of your existing home so you don't have to buy all new products and start from scratch. Connected cars and autonomous vehicles are also big at CES, with Audi, Mercedes, and Ford all showcasing the latest technology. All these innovations aim to help consumers stay connected wherever they are, whatever they're doing.